Start this noon hour with some breaking news. Metro Police investigating three separate shootings across the Circle City. All of them deadly. The latest happening along Emerson Avenue on the east side. Now, police say just before 9 a.m., officers responded to a call of a person down. When they arrived, they found a man dead in the parking lot of a BP gas station. EMS then pronounced him dead at the scene. It's definitely heartbreaking and devastating when we respond to any scene where a person has lost their life. Police are asking if you know anything, call Crime Stoppers at 262 TIPS. The other deadly shootings happen within minutes of one another. One took place on the northwest side, the other on the south side. CBS 4's Lexa Green is at the scene on the south side with more. IMPD officers told us earlier this morning that this was a random attempted home invasion that the homeowner here on the south side shot the suspect and that suspect died here on the scene. What we do know, officials got a call around 6 a.m. this morning for shots fired in this area. Just to give you an idea, this is a residential area with several fast food restaurants and homes nearby. Once officers arrived at this home, they did locate that victim. Right now, IMPD investigators are trying to figure out why this home was targeted. Meanwhile, they're reminding residents if you see any suspicious activity or people outside your home to pick up the phone and call police. At this time, we just encourage our residents to make sure that they're checking on one another. If you see anything suspicious in the area, we're asking you to report that information. If you see vehicles or people that you haven't seen before or they're checking in your neighbor's yard and you know that they don't belong, we're asking you to report that information so that officers can respond and check that out. At this time, IMPD officials say there is no ongoing threat to the public. In the meantime, they are still investigating. Any new updates will be sure to pass along to you on air and online. That's the latest on the South Side. Alexa Green, CBS 4 News.